Let me show you how to create a custom fan profile or, or a custom curve profile for your Asus ROG Li in order to maintain the best uh, cooling um, um, uh, system or the best ventilation for your device in order to keep the temperatures um, in, a, in, a, in good values. Um, at this point, uh, let me show you what to do. Basically, activate uh, the armory crate, just press, press the button here and you will have the settings and here you can find operating mode. Here in operating mode, you have these profiles. You have uh, windows, you have silent profile, which will activate by the way um, you also have shortcuts if you press the command center here you can activate uh, performance mode turbo mode uh, manual mode silent mode in this tutorial i'll show you how to create a manual mode for your device also when it's plugged in or when it's on battery like at this moment because you need to create two profiles i will show you immediately so with 10 watts you will get the best of your um, the best battery life 15 watts in the middle performance medium games and for more demanding games you will you will have turbo mode but turbo mode it's not enough for a very good uh, ventilation of your system so you will need um, a manual mode and to create a custom uh, curve for your uh, for your uh, device in order to activate um, to activate basically uh, the fans just hear them and to get the best of your device so in silent mode look here we have um, info performance mode turbo mode and manual mode so just go here to operating mode and you will have create a manual mode just press on create new or uh, if uh, if this screen doesn't appear you will have anyway the manual mode here press create a new uh, new mode and select for example for your uh, device to have the best um, uh, the best performance i will use every time uh, um, uh, this at the maximum uh, as you see here we have some um, some info every time anyway I uh, select them at maximum here to get the best performance let me get the mouse in order to see uh, better here on the screen what I'm pressing and you will have here in manual mode two graphics just uh, go to uh, to the first one which seems um, half uh, editable uh, because you cannot uh, lower these values I believe this is a protection for you anyway I uh, select um, at, uh, I start with here 10% um, of the fans uh, at 30 degrees if the device has 40 de degrees I, I want to get um, up to 26 um, 20, 29 of uh, of the cooling or you can let it here at 21 it depends if the noise uh, will um, will disturb you or not uh, the noise i mean from the fans um, ventilators in general i prefer to have a very good uh, ventilation and we go to the second fan this is the first one fan one and fan to speed here basically you have um, the capacity of the fan what capacity of the fan to be activated when you reach a certain um, temperature temperature here for your device so um, let's activate 10 per 11 percent at 30 degrees 20 at 40 and here let's increase it uh, even more uh, 42 percent of the fan at 50 degrees and i will go something like this you you can set your your own uh, your own uh, preferences here it depends 
how much of the fan of the capacity of the fan you want to be activated but keep in mind that your device will get will make more noise in this way so once you once you make your graphic here don't worry you cannot do something wrong as long as you increase uh, the, the capacity of the and the speed basically of your fans here you have to press uh, apply if you don't press apply you want to you want to activate uh, you won't have this profile basically so uh, at this point you have the cap the possibility to activate your manual mode so here let's let me show you how noisy it can get if you increase this at maximum this is just a test don't do something like this listen we have 50 degrees here 49 at this point we already started to have uh, uh, results look here 47 degrees at this point so the fans they really really work 46 degrees and uh, it's decreasing i can feel them here they are very strong 45 degrees for the for the system at this point keep in mind that we started with uh, 50 degrees or something like that at this point we have 45 degrees for the system and so on in games it's normal to increase to get higher temperatures here don't worry if you have if you see uh, higher values anyway just go and increase the 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 fan speed and you will uh, you will see how it keeps uh, lowering so at this point we decreased the the temperature uh, by seven degrees or maybe eight degrees look eight degrees at this point we have 42 degrees uh, 42 degrees uh, celsius here for the system let me activate the mode one and listen the the fan they are lowering the speed they make less noise and this is nice so in your gaming uh, sessions my advice create um, a manual profile for your games uh, in this way you will protect your uh, sd card and your system and um, you'll have the best results also you will keep the system cool and you will help the hardware to give you the best performance in games so in this way um, you create a manual profile for uh, for your system and again i repeat create a manual profile for your system because it's very important another aspect i almost forgot um, you have at this point a manual profile uh, for your uh, system when it's on battery make sure that when you create the profile you start with the charger connected or uh, if it's not connected check after that if you have the manual profile for uh, these two uh, 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 scenarios with charger connected and disconnected because in my case i created the manual profile with the charger connected and it wasn't available when i disconnected the charger i don't know maybe it was um, a glitch or not but uh, it's possible um, to have that profile only for charger so keep in mind create basically uh, these uh, profiles for charger connected and disconnected like this just check if you have the profile here when you connect and disconnect the charger look we have now 25 watt um, manual mode and when i when i connect the charger it goes to 30 watts uh, manual uh, pro uh, profile so custom profile
basically uh, two different uh, um, profiles. So this is it.